Hello guys, I'm terribly sorry, I'm just a complete loser. Um, if you look at the top screen, we are actually, we started over near the house on the left side of the map, the second from the left side of the map, but, um, and we actually went to the northern passageway and went to the cave and everything, and I was recording, just not recording both screens, so that's a problem, because I have to switch my recording from the top screen for Pokemon Pearl to both screens for Phantom Hourglass. So, uh, that's, that was, um, I just left it on the top screen, so, and it, it I would have left it how it was if it was just the bottom screen, but since it was the top screen and that doesn't show anything except the map, um, but I'm, I'm terribly sorry, I'm just, I'm really, really sorry. I'm sorry about that, guys, but all you missed was going through a cave and fighting monsters. That, that's basically it. Unlocked a few doors with keys. That's it. That's, that's, yep, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. And we found some treasure chest in the cave. Found some treasure chest in the cave and they weren't really hidden. They were kind of more out in the open. But, uh, looks like we're going to the milk bar. Or I believe that's what it is. That's what it is in Majora's Mask. Which is my favorite Zelda game. And I hope we can play that soon. Oh, hearty greetings. Lots of locals drifted here. Okay, um... So, we need to ask about Linebeck. So, could you tell us about Linebeck? Oh, that was perfect. He went to the Temple of the Ocean King. Temple of the Ocean King, um... Let me read this real quick. can't remember this part. Oh my gosh, so it like basically it sucks your life out of you. That doesn't sound great at all. Okay, so it looks like it's at the top of the map. If you were watching the top of the screen, you'll notice right now that the little top of the little giant stone like structure blinked up there. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to go up there. And I also I bought a shield. So, uh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Let's kill this thing. And then let's... Nope, doesn't look like there's anything in there, either. Okay, so, um, kill that. No, you didn't. There we go. And we need to kill this. Oh, blue rupees. That's, that's very lovely. That's very lovely indeed. Um, what else? Is there anything in here? I know rolling into trees. Ooh, five rupees. The dogs really need to shut up in the background, don't they? But, um, let's see. Let's see around here. Um... Let's see, we'll go over here. Oh, no, there's a cracked wall. And, um... Oop! Yep, we're here. Looks like we're here. So this is the Temple of the Ocean King. The temple was built to honor the mighty Ocean King, but the temple has fallen into ruin, and people say it's ruins any who enter. St ha ha ha. No pun intended, I'm assuming. Still, we have to find Lineback. So let's dive right in on in, like... Okay, let's go on in. Oh my gosh, skeletons are scary. What's that up there? Okay, that's a little bit freaky, but uh, let's talk to it. Can we? Whoa, what's that? The spirit? I foolishly entered this temple, and moments have drained the life right out of me. Okay. I don't know if there were. F I don't know about that, so let me pause this real quick. Sorry for that little interruption, guys. Something went wrong with the recording equipment. But, uh. And it usually does, doesn't it? But, uh, well, we're back. And that didn't do anything major. Um. Looks like, uh. Looks like, um, little fairy Celia is hearing something. What could she be hearing? Oh, look, it's, uh, it's a dude. Hey, dude. What you doing? Uh, looks like Linebeck. 
I believe that is Lineback. Uh, yep, that's Lineback, according to uh, Celia. Um, okay, and I'm I, I like him more and more because he says that Celia is bratty and annoying. Which, I agree with both statements. Not as bratty and annoying as Navi, but close enough. Next time I play through this, I am gonna have to answer no to everybody. Just to see what they say. Can I just destroy these? I believe I did. Oh hey, wait a second, there's something I forgot to tell ya. One thing you should know about this temple, it'll suck the life out of you. Great. So the younger you are, the more life you get. The less life you have to get sucked. Okay, Zelda theorization time. Do you guys believe that the heart containers in the Legend of Zelda series are actually to are actually, um, literal uh, showings of Link's growth in in the game, like his age growth, because you gain a heart, and I know he's not like, and that, that would be kind of funny. Um, I don't know what the 3 stands for, maybe the 3 stands for like 12? I'm not sure, but uh, like take every heart and then times it by a certain number. I'm not really sure. It, it's just a theory. It's just a theory. Or like months. I guess it could be months. Like he's 12 and 3 Oh, a treasure. Nothing is there. Okay. That's a fail. Oh, there's something in here. Yep. Okay, let's go down here now. Okay. Whew, I think we can take a quick breather. Looks like, uh... Lineback is a liar. That would make a lot of sense. Yes. Yes, it would. Okay. Um, yes, I know I'm pretty brave. I love Lineback's theme, by the way. It's just the... One of the best songs ever in the Legend of Zelda series. I'll just let you guys read this if you want. I'm just gonna kinda sit back and try to be quiet. <laughs> Uh, so enjoy for the brief moment of silence. Okay, so it looks like this little introduction of Linebeck is over, and now we know why that treasure chest was empty over there. It's because he found the key before we could get in here. So I don't really know why Nintendo put that in there, I guess to make it seem more realistic. It's like, oh, there's a treasure chest, and uh, there was a key in it, but this guy came in and took the key out of it, and I guess took the treasure chest with him. So, yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that they would get some questions from that. Um, on the forums, so, or just people in general asking the staff, because 
at E3 and stuff like that. Um, ooh, come on, run. Let's uh, get our hearts back. Now let's run. Let's run as fast as we can. Uh, we gotta get over to that other side. And oh, spikes, spikes, spikes. Okay, and okay, we got the other one down. Okay, K K K. Okay, now that we now that we have our channel though, um, have now that we have our channel available to record and upload videos longer than 15 minutes. Uh, I set that up actually just this morning after I uploaded the first Phantom Hourglass. But um, now that we have that, um, ah, I can't talk today. I say a lot of ums in my videos and I apologize for that. It's just that I have a lot on my mind and I can't remember. And it's like sometimes I just get sidetracked and don't know what I'm thinking about at the moment. So uh, sorry about that. Yep. And it looks like Linebeck has left us yet again. So, what a troll. I've officially lost my like for him and I'm back with the fairies. I still like him as a character, just don't like his attitude toward me in the game. I, but don't get me wrong, he's, an, he's one of my favorite characters out of the Zelda series. He's actually one of the funniest too in my opinion. I'm not just gonna sit here and let the fairy take words and shove them in my mouth. Make a stupid fairy. It's just like Navi all over again and Tattle and all the other fairies. They just talk for Link and they don't even give him a chance. Bring Midna back. No, seriously, they should bring Midna back. That was one of the best guides ever or bring back like a side game or something where you get to like play as Midna that would be boss like a Metroid take on the Twilight Realm except without all the futuristic alien alien things let's, let's kill this chicken, kill this chicken. Okay. guess we can't no come on no. Come on. Come on. I got a chicken. Aw, oh, dang. I can't throw it off. Well, well, well. Looks like it's Oceus is here. Apparently, I guess either he went through the Northern Passage or the bridge got fixed. Oh yeah, he said, or yeah, he just said that it got fixed, so, didn't he? Not you, fool, you're a wreck. It's so true. Look at his ship. I mean, how are you supposed to fit inside that? You can't even get a person across the gangplank without it breaking. It's a nice word. Oh, look at the chicken. It's all frozen in the background. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Standard map would simply show you... Oh, I see it. I see the flaky part. It's like right here. See? Because it was like discolored slightly. It had like little white lines on it. And there's a whale right there. What is that for? Okay, looks like that is the mark of. I believe I want to say Din. I believe it's the mark of Din. Yeah, because Faro is the like giant circle, and then it's like little half crescents to the left of it. I want to say it either left or right. I don't know, and then. Um, and then Nehru's is like, um, 
three crescents that are put together in like a triforce shape and then there's three circles facing away from the crescents and like that. So that must be Din's. That must be Din's. Another little easter egg there. Or was it? I don't know. Anyway, we'll find out soon, won't we? Are you set to? Um... Sure, let's go to the Isle of Ember. We got enough time. Okay, first time sailing. It's off to the open sea with us then. I'll leave all the navigation to you while I stay down in the engine room. Tap the feather pin icon to access the navigation chart. Just draw a line and the ship will follow the exact path and try it out. Okay, so we need to dock over here. Isle of Ember. Okay, let's go. Ooh, we can jump. That's, uh... Ah, oh, see the engine on the right? Tap stop to stop the resume. Tap go. Well, I'll see if you want to look around and see. Touch the screen set. Stay up alert. Okay, just stay alert. You just need to stay alert. Oh, look at the golden froggy! Here, riveting. Here, ribbit, ribbit. That's funny. Jump, 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 jump. Let's see if we can hit the seagulls. Nope. Oh, it looks like we're already here. That was fast. That's way different from Spear Tracks when it takes like forever to get just five minutes across but then again it kind of would make sense trains usually do take longer to go but this one is just so fast and that doesn't make any sense to me at all it, paddle boats are usually slow like that I, I, don't, I don't know why it's confusing yep I get you A monkey desk. Looks like we have been assigned the task of go finding the fortune teller Astrid. And no, he's just staying behind because Nintendo doesn't have the programming to. No, I'm just kidding. What's this say? Isle of Ember. That's uh, that's pretty basic. messed up about that. I don't know if it's the recording equipment or what. But, uh... But, uh, anyway, any matter, uh, be sure to join me next time where we, um, take on the challenge of finding the fortune teller Astrid, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out!